guys, what is up? It's HVL Manga here and welcome back to the YouTube channel. So you could probably guess where I'm sitting outside of right now. I am currently sitting outside of, can you see it? Can you see it? It's right there. Nope. It's right there. No, it's not. Not in the camera. It's right <laughs> I'm currently sitting outside of a Barnes and Noble. It is currently 3 p.m. on a Wednesday, March 9th. So I'm currently sitting outside of this Barnes and Noble and I thought that I would take you guys along. So the, the really the only objective today um, is to find Beastars Volume 17. And I don't know when this video is going up, but it's currently the 9th. Okay, it's currently the think think through this with me. It's currently the 9th. The volume actually technically gets released on the 15th, but uh, Barnes & Noble has been going crazy with early releases recently. Today's, I guess, vision, Barnes & Noble, and then I'm also going to uh, insert some clips that I took, I think a couple weekends ago, from a different manga store that I haven't shown you guys yet. Um, but first, let's go to Barnes & Noble, see what they have, and fingers crossed for Beastars Volume 17. Okay, so have some of the bigger cut stuff, Berserk 3. I actually was able to find 10 a couple days ago, so I definitely scooped that up. Some 20th Century Boys. I still need 21st Century Boys in the singles. I don't know when that's gonna happen. Alice in Borderland. This is another new release. I haven't read this yet. I've picked it up, but I haven't read it yet. I'm probably gonna read that today. I'll definitely let you guys know what I think on my Instagram. Ajin, this. I read this, actually loved it. I thought it was really, really good. It really makes me want to pick up Dragon Ball. <laughs> so I'll probably do that in the future. Heard this is really good. Um, I love this series. I'm very, very excited for volume five to come out. I think it's coming out in June. So I have a while yet, but I love this series. Attack on Titan, Assassin's in Classroom. This is another one that I want to give a shot, but I'd probably just go the box set route. Um, Asadora, I want to read this as well. Anything by Urasawa, I'm down for. Uh, more Attack on Titan. Barakamon, you always see like volume 18 in stores, I feel like. Also, this is so nice. It's like, I just color panels of some Attack on Titan scenes, which I thought was really, really cool. I don't have the Attack on Titan manga, but that is really, really cool. A lot of volumes of Bacano. I don't know if this is expensive or not. Um, volume 7 of Banana Fish. <laughs> this might be something that I want to collect eventually, but who knows. Um, oh, absolutely. Okay, this is what I was coming for. Beastars volume 13, or 17. Need to get the best volume. You know how it is. I love Beastars, it's so freaking good. If you haven't read it yet, please do. It's so good. I read these as soon as I get them. So freaking good. Some Battle Angelita, volume one actually. That's interesting. I don't know why that's not by volume 18. Some really nice editions of that. Um, a lot of Black Butler as always. Bloodlad Volume 1. I saw this at another Barnes & Noble too. Is this good? Do we like that? What's, what's, what's the thoughts? Black Lagoon. This is a series that I kind of want to give a shot, but a lot of the volumes are kind of expensive right now, and I don't want to pay over retail for them, so we're just gonna also... Someone's doing an audit of the manga. I wish them luck. Can't be good results. <laughs> um... I've heard this is really good. I've heard this really good. And I think it's complete with only four. I'm not entirely sure. Um, this is new as well. Don't know anything about it. I think this is done by, oh, I forgot what else she's done. Inu is it Inuasha? I'm not entirely sure, but she's a very famous manga, I believe. Call of the Night, I've heard is really good as well. Um, Bride Story, I feel like that's something that I would really enjoy. But I feel like they're kind of expensive, so we're just gonna wait on that one probably. Um, Chainsaw Man, always good to see some Chainsaw Man here. Don't need any Chainsaw Man, but good to see it. Classroom of the Elite, I need to get volume one. I need to get that. I don't know why I haven't yet, but I just haven't. Chobits, all four of them. I don't know if there's more than four, but it's nice that they're there. I'm just gonna set said that there. <laughs> what is this? 
What is this? Samra Tezuka? What? Do we know what this is? This looks like, it feels like more of a book. Okay, I'll fix that later. <laughs> um, I want to give this a shot eventually as well. Just haven't gotten to it. Um, some D Gray Man, I've heard that's really good. Some Dragon Ball. The Vizbigs for Dragon Ball isn't too bad, I don't think, honestly. Um, really good. I love that. I highly recommend it. It's a good, it just, I don't know, it feels, it's like, it feels good reading it, you know? <laughs> I've also heard that this is very good. Very, very good. I've heard a lot of people talking about it, but I don't know if I'll pick it up. I don't know, maybe. Maybe one of these days. A fruits basket. I also heard good things about this. This is good. Love free run. Um, Fist of the North Star. I'm not collecting it, but the new one is out. Look, this man built different. <laughs> Jeez. Um, some Goblin Slayer. Girl without the face. No idea what that's about, but I, I feel like I've heard good things. I might not have. Yeah, exactly. Remember, Girls Lost Two. I've heard is really good. Uh, Grand Blue Dreaming. I read it. I couldn't get into it. I couldn't do it. So there you go. There's my take on Grand Blue Dreaming. It'll probably be in a manga I dropped video in the future. <laughs> okay. Hellbound. I like the show but why would i get this so i can just read it online for free on webtoon you know picked this up the other day i haven't read it yet but i'm looking forward to it it's the last volume which is kind of sad but it's fine <laughs> hurry mia this is one that i want to give a shot but i don't know how committed i am because there are a lot of volumes but we'll see maybe i'll just watch the anime first Um, Hunter Hunter. I know, I think the covers are so interesting for some of these volumes. Um, I do want to collect um, Yu Haka Show from the same manga though, so that I have a couple volumes, but it's gonna be a journey for sure. They're not cheap. <laughs> um, Miwashiki, another one that I want to read eventually. I don't know like any of these. <laughs> okay. Um Junji Ito's Cat Diary. A lot of JoJo's, love to see it, and a good amount of Jujutsu Kaisen as well, which is always good. I'm not gonna lie, I've seen this and I've been tempted to pick it up. I have no idea why. N no idea why. I'm not going to, but I'm always slightly tempted. <laughs> uh but very excited for the second one. Um, Comey. Comey Volume 1. We're going to do this. Oh, is this a high invested? Okay. Um, I get Land of the Lustrous, and there's another one. I forgot what the other one's called, but I get this and another one mixed up all the time. I forgot what it's called. Ah, shoot, I'm gonna remember it later, and then I'm gonna be mad that I didn't remember it. But I get that. Oh, Man in Abyss. I don't know why I get these two mixed up all the time. I don't know why. I've heard they're both, both decent. Also, what are they doing with... Why do they have big omnibuses like this in Barnes? I'm always so confused when I see it. Um... My Sunny Koku, this is one that I love the releases of. And I feel like I could like it, like there's part of me that would like it, but I don't know if I want to commit to that right now. <laughs> National Volume 5, best believe I already have that. 
I only see Mao, and I'm always slightly tempted to give it a shot, but I don't know. We'll see. A lot of volume ones in Moriarty. I feel like I haven't seen that recently. Monster volumes. Mm. Mob Psycho, another one that I always think that I'll pick up, but then I look, look at the art and I'm like, mm, maybe not. <laughs> that might just be an anime only for me. My Dress Up Darling, I've heard everyone's going crazy over the anime right now. I do want to see how it looks. What's the art like? Okay, well, the art seems decent. I'll put that back later, don't worry. Um, a lot of vigilantes as normal. Nana Volume 1, another one that I'll probably just watch the anime for, that I've heard is really, really good. Um, Noragami, I love Noragami, it's so good. Okay. Oh my goddess, a really random, <laughs> random omnibus, okay. One Piece, box sets come back in stock. Okay, this is another one that I might give a shot. Okay, so yeah, I don't know if I'm going to pick this up. I love the release. The release is beautiful, but I don't know if I'm going to pick it up. This was adorable. That was so cute. Mm, Parasite, really good anime. Overlord, I need to read mine yet. Ping Pong. This is another one that I've heard like good things, but also kind of mixed reviews. So I haven't picked it up yet, so I don't know if I will. Um, but yeah quintessential quintuplets definitely go the box set route if you want to collect that mm -hmm. heard really good things about this I've seen more people pick it up i don't know what it's about though but i've heard good things record of ragnarok is really really good a lot of recreant i feel like they're doing a reprint of this series which is good because a lot of the volumes are kind of in and out of stock Sailor Moon. Mm. What are these? I have no idea what these are. I don't know if I've ever seen these before. That's interesting. Mm. I heard this is really good. Fifteen classroom vibes, but I haven't read it yet. seven C's. I will say these omnibuses look better. I like how they're actually decently connecting, but the heights are different, which is a bummer. But that's definitely probably one of the best connecting omnibuses I've seen. And the box sets right here. See, like, these are bad. Those are good. <laughs> Solo leveling. That's really good as well. This is really cute. I read all three of these. I don't know why the third one's in plastic wrap, though. It doesn't really make sense, because it's not. I didn't think it was bad. <laughs> Some illustration books. Soul Eater in the singles. That's always kind of cool to see. I wonder why they went different colors like that, though. Not sure why. Mm. A lot of Spy Family. Mm. Sweat and soap. I will say, look at these volumes. They're really damaged. That's actually really sad. That's not good. Mm. The, there's a box set. That's kind of cool. Love seeing more box sets be released. Definitely the cheapest way to go when collecting the series normally, at least. Um, Toilet Bound and Toilet Bound Zero. I actually picked up a volume already, but yeah, glad to have that released. A lot of Tear Eternity. I didn't like the time skip, but that's fine. 
Ubo, how do you say this? Ubo Blot? I want to give this a shot. Um, a lot of Uzumaki, Junji Ito stuff. Undead Unluck. Another one that if I read, I'll probably just read on the app. Vinland Saga, love seeing it. Mm. Witch and the Beast, highly recommend. Really, really good stuff. Has anyone bought this? I don't think I've seen it anywhere. Does anyone like it? Did anyone read it? What do we think? <laughs> Dawn. I want to get the entire series, but a lot of the earlier volumes are super out of stock right now and really expensive. So I just need to wait for a reprint because this was really, really good actually. I really liked it. Okay, so I just got out of the Barnes and Noble and first up, I met one of you guys in there, which is actually crazy because uh, uh, this is like my first interaction with anyone who's watched my video. So uh, dude, if you're watching this video, Hello, I hope you enjoyed the Batman movie. I hope you liked it. Overall, this trip was very much a success. I met one of you guys and uh, I found the volume that I was looking for and something else. So the volume that I came looking for, you guys know, Beastars volume 17. Very excited to have this volume. I will be reading it today amongst a lot of other volumes that I recently got. So very excited for this volume. I freaking love Beastars. And actually the next manga that I got is one that I've had my eye on for a while, but I've kind of always been hesitant to get into because I know a lot of the volumes are, I don't know if it's, they're probably out of print, not entirely sure, but that is Ubel Blot, I think that's how you say it, volume zero. So this is obviously the first volume, well, I guess the zero volume. So I'm gonna read this, see what I think, and decide kind of from there if I wanna collect it. I have heard from a lot of people that this series is really good it's very dark and obviously i like that sort of thing so hopefully i like this we will have to see um but i'll definitely keep you guys posted on my instagram so if you want to know my thoughts definitely follow me on hbl manga that's where i post all of my thoughts on the manga that i'm reading there um so yeah that was everything that i got from barnes and noble so as i said in the beginning i'm gonna transition into another store that i went to with some friends so uh if there are people there that's why that's why um it's a store kind of like an hour or so away from me that has manga for like five dollars each which is an insane deal um so yeah i'll transition to that and then from there i'll do the outro okay so this is the manga it's all for a couple dollars which is actually really really nice a lot of it truthfully is like old shoujo stuff air gear is kind of cool though a lot of old shoujo that i don't know about truthfully like i I don't know what this is. This might not be shoujo, but there's a lot of stuff that I don't know about. I, I have heard though that this is pretty good. Astro Boy. Like they have, yeah, they have some cool stuff. I'm with my friend. Say hello. Hi. <laughs> May's also around here somewhere. She's getting something though. Um, Battle Royale. I don't know if this is connected at all to the the actual Battle Royale manga. I have no idea. Always look for volume three of Bokorano. Unfortunately not here, even though I already have it. A lot of case closed, and they're in like good condition. I feel like a lot of case closed, it's like really crappy condition, or at least from what I've seen, but those are really good. Um, some more stuff that I don't know. <laughs> What'd you got? Thank you. <laughs> Just joking about, okay. This screams. Oh, I don't know what it screams, but it just screams. <laughs> it screams, period. Uh, oh my gosh, leave me alone. <laughs> you know what, everyone's gonna have something. Dragonair Academy, absolutely not. That, oh no, that's so bad. That's so bad. Dreaming Sun, I've heard that some of these volumes are, I don't think they're out of print, but I think they're super out of stock. Gone single, that's kind of cool. Flowers of Evil single. I don't like an audience. <laughs> You're just watching. Oh, you know how it be. Yep. I Shield 21. This is where I was able to pick up a majority of my set. Like, this is an insane amount of Eye Shield. So, yeah, that works out well for me. K 
Genshin, Genshiken? Yeah, Genshiken. Um, random 18 of Golden Kamui. Like, I feel like that doesn't belong here. Uh, a lot of GTO. A lot of GTO. Um... Yeah, see, a lot of these titles, I don't really know what they are. Judge? I want Judge, but I just don't want to go through the pain of finding Volume 3. Um... Ikigami. Really, really good. I always look for Volume 1 because I want to replace my Volume 1 because it has the old Viz like thing at the top and I want to replace that so that it's all matching, but I can never find Volume 1. It is a tragedy, you're right. Um... I feel, like, I feel like I remember Kieran needing these from Kieran and Tommy. I don't remember though. I texted her about it. Hopefully she messages me back. Um, a lot of Siren. I need volume 10 though. I've been looking for volume 10 for so long. I haven't found it yet, which is so sad. Real account, I wish they had volume one. I don't know what that is. I'd buy real account if they had a volume one, but they didn't. Roni Kenshin, I want more of that as well. Um, Sunny, I've heard Sunny's really, really good. This is another one that I always see and always think about picking up, but they don't have the <laughs> earlier volumes. And again, I don't wanna have to go through that pain of trying to find them. Toriko. Um, waiting for Spring Woji. Oh! <gasps> Okay, explain to me what you just did. Um, so like, it's like a special little lottery game over there. where you get these little ticket things and it comes like this where it's closed and then mm -hmm. you have to rip it open and then it indicates which prize you get. Which H apparently was a good one because I got, he's my favorite. <gasps> Let me see. Okay, he's stretching. He's so cute. And then, oh, E is better, but H is like the bottom one you can get, but it's like, what is, what, is, what is that? It's Gojo. Oh no. It's a little Gojo figure, and I'm not. It's, and I want to make fun of him so bad. Oh yeah, you have to make I'm fun so of Gojo. Excited. He needs. He needs that. He this needs to be made fun of. Win. Dude, good. How much? How much the was it? Tickets that? are only eleven dollars, but a lot of the prizes are like more than that. More than that? Like these normally yeah. sell for like twenty-five dollars. Nice, dude. Because you know it's an acrylic thing. Yeah. Apparently the next one's My Hero Academia, so I will not be partaking. I will not be either. <laughs> Are you sure though? Yeah, unless I can get um, Genki, I don't want it. That's fair. And that's a risk to take to yeah, get Genki. Yeah, considering how many characters there are. Yeah, exactly. And he's a very minor character, to be honest. Yeah. All right, so this is all the manga, essentially. I mean, it's a good selection, but it's a lot of really- the What? What? Ain't no way, bruh. Favorite manga. <laughs> <laughs> cop ASAP. They also have a lot of Shonen Jump magazines, like older ones, which is pretty cool. So, I looked through these already. Nothing that I really want, but kind of really cool. So, that's the manga with the ladies. With the ladies. So, yeah. I think I'm going to pick some up for some people that I know. Because I know, I know Manga Hero needs volume 7, so I'm going to get this for him. I think I'm gonna get that. I'm I'm a sucker for androids. It's so bad. I you know. know you're gonna get I know I'm a sucker for androids. <laughs> I think he looks so good. Alphonse. I always want to just call him Elric. I look at him. Elric. <laughs> Elric. I know it's not his name. He also looks pretty good. They're making a massive one of this one. They're gonna make a, like a freaking big one. Another one. Watch out! Watch out! Watch out! Sorry. Another one. Yeah, they're just making it bigger though. Like big. You know, I was looking for that. That's an androids. Um, Mia, Mia Mura. Oh, the Nendroid. Right oh, that's actually really sad. Love him. I'm still thinking about getting the Daisuke Kamen. Is he here? No, I saw him online for like sixty bucks. Oh, really? He was here last time. I feel like. <laughs> <laughs> Why is it always necessary to choke them when you have a plushie? That's hilarious. Look at they have Okay, Daichi immediately. Yeah, I like that one a lot, child. actually. Really? Yeah. 
So yeah, a lot of Nendroids from pretty much everywhere. I got my Bleach Nendroid from here, or my Ichigo Nendroid from here. <laughs> <'cause> <laughs> yeah, they do, and he's expensive. They know how to price popular characters, that's for sure. Have they made Tengen um, yet? Yeah, it's actually, well, he, they, he's made, he's just not in production right now. Dude, you could, look, this could be like a necklace charm. I wanted to get one. I wanted to get that hey, for my desk at work. I'm not gonna lie. I love these figures. They're so cool. I almost. I want this one so bad. I want it so bad. Ooh, these are like different dogs. Yeah, this is nice. They're solid. Look at that. They got the water effect. That's so that is pretty nice. That looks what like a nice. Doing? I'm going over your head. I didn't like that. Oh, you a could get lot your shoe of you like crane game kind of. Figures. ABC. If only his little stompers weren't out. I saw his feet. <laughs> He's my favorite, but his stompers are always out. Give yeah, him shoes. I don't like seeing their the and feet. Michael Jackson. Michael Jackson. Oh my word. It's re <laughs> my word. It's a requirement when there's plushies to literally choke them out for some reason. Whenever our friend does it, her knuckles get like white. Yeah, she's like awesome. holding on. Some posters as well. I don't know what's playing. What's playing right now? Is that my hero? Yeah, it is my hero. I haven't watched my hero. I don't know what it's about. Oh my word. Oh my word. I actually really like that. It <laughs> built different. I can reach. You can reach. I'm so proud. Good job. Get, a, get like a little dog. Dog reach. <laughs> Backpack child. Leash kid. Leash kid. Were you a leash kid? I wasn't. Were you? <laughs> no. What? Well, listen, no judgment if you were. I was the good kid. I was the deep fried Out kid. Out of the six. Out of the six. That's fair. Oh, I wanted to show you this. Come here. Look okay. it. Ooh. Uh, that's actually pretty cool. Yeah, I thought you'd like it. That is pretty cool. I like it a lot. Some stuff over here. Pretty standard stuff that you see in like Target too. Whatever has been a What's what? Uh, this is. <laughs> she block. <laughs> I really like that leash. Oh, trust me. I know. A lot of squishmallows over there. <laughs> I know you do. I know you do. I also have a lot of pops, which I don't really love pops, but. This store is very, very serious. More things. Long cat. So yeah, this store is just has a bunch of everything. They have comics as well on the other side. Like comics over there as well. So it's really, really nice. I like that a lot. Very, very nice. A lot of different stuff. I could spend so much money in here. The manga is good, but it's it's cheap. But there's just like really random volumes. That's the problem. But other than that, the manga is really good. Really cheap again, it's like a couple bucks each. I was able to finish and find a lot of my eye shield here, which was super cool. So yeah, that is the manga. Okay guys, so uh, I'm gonna be real. I didn't find any volumes there. I didn't get anything there. Um, the, vo the volumes are good. I like that they're cheap, but they're also like really random volumes that I don't need. So uh, obviously I didn't get anything if I don't need it. So I didn't get anything there. So that is essentially my manga shopping vlog experience. Um, but yeah, so again, the haul for this vlog was Beastars Volume 14 and Uva Blot Volume 0. Very excited for these two, especially Beastars. I hope that I love it, and I hope that I love Ubo a lot as well. So guys, thank you so much for watching today's manga haul, trip, whatever. Um, tomorrow I'm actually going on a road trip with my friend May for manga shopping. We're literally traveling like three hours for manga. It's a little obsessive, so uh, definitely be on the lookout for that video coming out relatively soon. But 
very excited uh, for the pickups today. I'm gonna go get some food because I am a ravenous and I will see you in the next video. Guys, thank you so much for watching. I really appreciate you guys and I will see you in the next video. Bye guys. Thank you.